Hey folks, welcome back to Manor Lords. And why did I save it here? I wonder. Gandalf and... Oh, I know what it was. In between episodes, I was looking for our deer. And I noticed some of them were back in the original place again. Uh, click you, you. So pop all these on. And where are we? We're all over the place. Interesting. Um, this is Gandalf. And in this direction here. So we're what? All at home? Uh, hunting camp. Yeah, we're all kind of at home right now. You are harvesting. So you're, they're all back at camps where they are. But last time we saw them all heading away from here. Not knowing where they actually got the uh, the meat, but they were all dragging carcasses. So since then, they've gone back to camp, or they're on their way to camp with another carcass or two. But what I saw, actually it was from, well, it was right here. We're now hunting in here again. And he dropped one right there. Okay. Any more heading this way? You are... Transporting male armor. Okay. Well, yeah. Anyway, there were some deer that had made it back into this area. I went searching and searching and searching and I found two. So what that really means, I don't know. But there's 22 deer somewhere on this map. And I don't even know if they know where they are. You guys are all home or you're getting drunk. Yeah, yeah. It hunts over. Anyway, we've got a lot of noises happening in the background right now. Uh, Gimli's got a lot of burgage plots that are going on. I did set some over... Oh, that was up tier 3. Okay, got these guys all up and running. Great. In fact, let's set your extra house. No, you're just a single house over here. Okay, and you are done. You are done. You don't have... This is two houses. That's right. When there's not enough room... Well, maybe not. I've seen them build them on top of each other. I think it is. Yellow house, beige house. Yeah, they're kind of on top of each other. There wasn't enough room over here. Too tiny of a little footprint. I already get this this benefit of a little house and, and, and big veggie. But I did turn on a bunch of the second houses for these. And I see they've been building those. Let's quickly set some more chickens over here. Just to... Uh, Make sure we have a whole bunch of a third or fourth, whichever one it is. Um, you're over here to uh, food type for this area. And in between episodes, I got the last of the trading goods figured out for, whoa, for their trader in, in Gloin. And we still only have five families, so they're doing the best they can. And I found someone to work in all of the berry patches. Uh, Gimli just got a boost because we got that last, uh, um, yeah, tier three. Where are we at? Over here. Got these guys in. We did set another one of these guys to be tier three. And did I get you going? Yeah, I got you clicked as well. So did that in between episodes. So tier threes are all happening around here. We kicked around tier threeing this whole row right here. May as well just do it. That will give us the last points that we need, if it will let me. Not met. You need you need booze. Why do you need booze? We have booze over here. You had some. Somebody had some. Okay. Have you guys drank it all? No, there's still thirty. They just have to go find it. Okay, um, we are turned on, right? Tavern? Yeah, we're turned on in all three of them now because of that uh, lack of entertainment that was starting to plague us, so I ended up turning it back on. But we've got somebody doing berries in all three of the major provinces now. Someone's in each, one family in each of the uh, for, forager huts, and it took a little bit of shuffling to make that one work, so I managed to keep one or two uh, families out and about building things. I set a few more houses right in here to kind of get all this going. I did I did some work in between episodes on purpose. Didn't show it during the episode because I kind of wanted to spend a bunch of time 
Uh, yeah, there's Earhart. A bunch of time playing over in this one. This is the province we just picked up, and wasn't sure if I was really going to do one or not. I think I'll go ahead and start a smaller one over here, and this one's not going to be responsible for a lot of stuff. Just going to, you know, harvest some food and you know eat some food and and maybe harvest some stone and, and iron and clay and send it off rather than do anything with it and then you know harvest some more food and then eat some more food so i'm thinking about calling this one pippin <laughs> that just seems like it fits i n or e n i think it's i n i think it's that way yeah pippin so this one is going to be our probably our final settlement I don't see the need to continue building settlements over here. We're just going to conquer these just to see what the uh, the end of the game looks like. But let's spend a little time playing with this one. And we've done almost everything we need to do in the other ones. They've got plenty of projects to be working on. they got berries to work on. There's food coming in. I don't think there's much I have to do over there except for drop into Gloin once in a while to see if another family popped in so we can set them to, I don't know, making logs or something. But Pippin, let's set you up with a small settlement. And let's see here. That's that one. And trading posts? No. What do I want here? Not monies. Administration. Right there. Settlers camp. And somewhere in this area, I may as well just set up a single granary, which will empty the bread that is made here, but also grab these so I guess we'll set this up right in this area so that you've been there town and do we want to wait a minute okay I I would always go with the smallest one because we've got the support system now from all of the other towns to send aid and to help out but I got a little criticized last time for going the, the lowest one so we'll, we'll we'll do one of these just to just to see what it's like but so that gives us more logs gives us more bread and unfortunately it doesn't give us more people but we did just eat through 500 coins there we're up and running they're over here and let's hmm let's think about things a little bit here we know we want to grab foods out of here so we know we're going to want a granary in this area we're not going to want to do the uh, logging camp up in this area so let's do this and gathering and no logistics and granary let's get that going immediately and i'm thinking we'll tuck it in like so where's the tree i'm taking out okay so we can go in like that all right and let's toss a road i can turn you on now and actually let's put one of these in too we're at let's put you in all like over here and I guess for that matter, let's get this other one moved away and over in that area too. So we'll do what we're going to do over here. Now I never did look at the emmer potential over here. I don't think there was much. Oh, you're right in here where the berries are. Yeah, we're not going to worry about that. Okay. So move the oxen out of there. And let's get a, a, uh, a camp set up. Gather and logs. And... We want to clear out here first. I guess we'll take this whole little peninsula out. And long term, well, we can move this later. So short term, let's make a quick, easy walk. So does that mean even get it? Nah, we'll do it right over here. I think so. You're like that. Let's give you a road. Bring you through. Like that. Don't know where you're going to connect yet. We know we want a road that goes from here on into the woods something like I can't see the, the berries from here so we'll just kind of take you around like like that and end you they're up in here somewhere and food right now it does make sense let's get the, the berries going immediately since we're in season so let's see turn you off move you around a little bit so something like this there was a spot you're over here yeah we'll do that and road you in 
I think that tree's right in the way, isn't it? <laughs> okay, well, we'll do that anyway. So you're in there. What else do we need? What are we talking about up here? Five houses and exposed goods. Yeah, we need to get the need to get the other warehouse up and going too. And up in this area somewhere, we need to be pulling the hides out of here. So it makes sense we're doing both kind of from the same place. Um, I think it'd look good right in here. Right like that. Okay. Road you guys together. Sure. Shoot you across. And how do we get into here? We could house this way back into the woods. So let's kind of run down around like this and then head straight in to there. I like that. Houses... I can set them now since we have the extra logs. So H for house and exactly how, what does this give us? Into here and around, something like that, minus you for a while. Are we really hurting on logs? Not enough goods. We're in there for logs, one, two, three, four. Gives us plenty of chickens in the background and yeah, we'll do that. I was going to debating whether to just do two at a time and make a nice curve in the back, but not that important. We're going to need one more, though, as soon as we get another timber in. So this guy is our first priority right here, Forager's Hut. And get that one going, and then come over here and get this one going. And minus one. Okay. So you guys are doing that. Actually, hmm... Let's, oh, Granary is in. Let's put two families in there and get this pile of bread cleaned up first. So once that's done, then they'll hit the other ones. Okay, that's good. So you guys are okay for a moment. Over here, we are in March. A lot of things are happening. Uh, charcoal Kiln wants a place for a stall in Gimli. Gimli Charcoal, uh, charcoal Kiln. So you guys... Okay, and we've got just, yeah, just the three over there, and this one filled up, it was over there, okay, and I thought we had, I guess that was it, okay, well, let's put another one over here, actually, we have a lot of people living over here now, uh, where am I, over here, really gonna need more market space over here, but if it's the charcoal kiln that's asking for it, it doesn't make sense to to send them too far away. What's right in this area? You can't really put a house right here. So let's grab you and you and drop you. That road doesn't go through. Let's make that happen first before I block something. So we'll just kind of take you around a curve and drop you straight in. Yeah. Now let's see what kind of a market we'll build in this area. You to you to something like that. Six, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so you're in. I was trying to get over here, though. We have still just five, so we're we're waiting for April. We are. Okay, um, Pippin requests a market stall. Okay, that makes sense. Though, yeah, I guess I can let you guys kind of set up. Boy, I thought that was a wild boar walking through the, the woods with the shadows really big wild boar where do we want to do that let's go across like so and we do need to put a well in too so let's grab let's first of all grab well no water in here at all Ooh, and nothing oh wow look at how little water is on this map <laughs> yeah this is a disaster just waiting to happen all right we're gonna go here first we'll continue this nice little winding curve and do what there's also no king's roads in this entire map if you've noticed that so let's give them a bit of a road kind of don't see any contour lines a very few let's get us into here so around like like this Oh, really? Now? Okay, so there we're April. 
and let's come on around. Since we own both of these, apparently it's going to let us draw across uh, county lines here. Okay, so that gives us a way to connect from Gandalf in and then from Gandalf to everywhere else. Okay, um, I was talking about a well, but I needed to know where the road was going to be. So grab you, and would it help to drop multiples here since it's the only place? Just in case they have to stand in line to use it. I suppose that's a possibility. Uh, rotate you just a little. Pop you in there. Definitely want another one back over in here. Not off logs. Okay. So got to get you built first and then we can do more of those. Now the market would be where the well was, was my plan. That's not going to work. Okay. So let's just give you a nice little market kind of in this area. Yeah, let's do let's do four right there. So there is a market. Though these families are not going to have time to do anything with it anyway. The one thinks they are. But I really want you guys just hauling all these in before the next rainstorm hits. Okay, bunch more noises and Gindy, Gimli, Gandalf, Samwise, all kinds of burgage plots and stuff. All right, so that's right. Gimli did get a point. Gimli got a point. There we are. And Gimli didn't send the point. You are headed toward... I think you're going into deep mining. I think we need to just do that. So close that and let's get this set up so that there's no longer a risk of something going wrong here. You're going to do that. And you too. You too. Alright, multiple deep mines in here. Okay. With that going, we... What was the reason why we didn't set the rest of these? It was beer. Okay. I'll set you until we don't have enough supplies to set anymore. Your one also? Yeah. So you three and you two. And all of you are going to be tier threes. And that should satisfy the need to uh, get us up to our last point and get us up to plate mail. So yeah, that's going to work out well. Six families. Six families, six families. Why do I have six families? Hmm, I pulled some out so I could do berries, but I don't remember pulling that many out. Six families. Um, do I want to keep six families, or do I want to get some more? What are we doing here for for iron and iron slabs? Iron is looking great, iron slabs. So let's not worry about that. Clay is here, 50, and roofing tiles. We never did get roofing tiles going. Here. We set this up a long time ago. I don't think we ever got around to it. So let's just get you going and use up that clay. Okay. Um, otherwise, we'll leave the other five families. Although, that being said, 37 of 40. Let's get one in each. One is in each. Uh, let's get two in each. That means your deer have moved. Yeah, your deer have moved. Who knows where you're going to hunt now? You... Pop you aside and hit people. And pull you aside and hit people. You guys are going where now to hunt? You are dragging a carcass. And you are mm, following a horse while you're dragging a carcass. That horse isn't your best buddy, is it? Why is there a horse following that hunter? Uh, okay. Animals as pets is kind of fun to watch. Unless it's an animal that's supposed to be trading. You're transporting meat. Uh, transporting meat. To your home? Because, you know, the hunting camp's over here. And the granary's over here. So you're transporting meat where? <laughs> that was an odd thing. To a market? Okay. But there isn't a market out over here. I just hired you. Okay. That might be it. I just hired you, and you are on your way to get me to transport or something like that. Okay. So, Gimli's good now. Uh, berries are decent. Okay. Berries, decent. And over here, yep, we're doing okay. And we need to get going on this one. Are we? We are now. Did we get the bread picked up? Uh, here we have... I uh, don't know what we started with this time, but it seems reasonable that to have 40. Is it 20 and 40? Doubled? It could be. Uh, people? 
You are waiting and guiding an ox. You guys are done here. Uh, general, minus, minus. Great. So, is this guy built? This guy is built. We want two in there. Let's set you for at least over the clay area. And just in case this gets into the stone area too, let's take all of that out. You guys start there. Now, we're going to need firewood, but we got to wait for these first timbers to come in. Okay. So, you guys are two people left building. And you are, you need burgage plots or you're going to be freezing in the winter. Can, you know, April can be a little bit chilly, I, I will say that. But one person guiding an ox and where, have we moved everything? The ox, you are here. The other one was supposed to go nearby. Are you still in here? You, that's supplies. Where's the other... Okay, let me grab a building. Uh, something like this. There you are. Once you have this, everything kind of highlights. So you are building this right now. And... You're done. Come on, tap, tap. We have to wait for her to walk over. There we go. Let's put a family in here. One family and... Actually, let's get an ox ordered. So, I guess... Um, do you have a... You don't have a... Okay. You do livestock. Yeah. You're where I want to put a family. So you guys who do nothing but move logs back and forth and everywhere they're needed as fast as you can. One family left to do the building. And two fa whoa. We're about to lose some berries. One more family in there. So only one family in here getting logs. Okay. So you're in there. Uh you guys are done. What am I missing? Oh, fifth one is actually the one that's doing the constructing. Okay, I was hoping to find one more family to steal, but that's not going to happen. So, we'll just come back to you guys in a little bit. All right, so Gandalf and Gloin. Gloin did get another family. Great. Um, where are our families here now? You're not in there. You could go back into there soon just to get that done. There's 23 over here. It'd be nice to get those sold so we can turn them into money. And I'm guessing we have to have a family here in order to do that. So that's where you're going to go. There's nobody making logs right now, but we still have nine timber. There is nobody in here, but we've got uh, eight months of fuel until we get another couple houses filled. You guys are there. We do have somebody in here and in here. Uh, the tannery would be good. So we can get some, some leather in here. Tannery, did that actually get done? I remember thinking it needs to be up in this area. There you are. So let's kick you up. You're next. So, <laughs> still need one family over here. Okay, so you are one family doing berries. And you may not be enough to keep up. I doubt you will be. Okay, so... I guess temporarily we're going to give up on that idea. Let's get all the berries out of here that we can. So plus one there. And if I were to steal somebody else, who would that be? It's one, two, it's three, four. It's five. No, there's nobody getting logs. Woodcutter's Lodge, Saw Pit. It was somebody over here. That one, that's five. Hmm... Let's pull you out. It, it didn't work. The saw pit still has no logs, even though someone has been assigned here and there are logs available and the ox isn't being used and you're not doing anything either. Wow. Okay. Well, in that case, the one family can try to figure out something to do. All right. So you're doing that and berries are still great over here. We're not getting overwhelmed anywhere. Good. And curious if Gandalf's deer ever did really show up good dousing of rain in here no they're not in this area they did haul a few deer out of here why they went into here I don't know so I still don't know where they are I'm always curious if it's, it's not something that I can fix but it is interesting to see how a game can kind of go wrong <laughs> is this enough you are I always find you guys hauling them back I never find you hunting where are you hunting at? Are you hunting? Ah, uh, you are. Okay, finally. Let's track you. I seem to be going the right direction. 
Let's get ahead of you. Yep, deer, deer, deer. Right here. Almost. I see, we're kind of in the forest we were before. I didn't see him when I went looking for him last time. And I guess they went from here out to the King's Road. When we saw everybody hauling him in. And they worked their way over to here. Then worked their way up this pathway. Instead of just coming straight over here to the pathway. It probably took the, the shortest route to a King's Road. Yeah. And I noticed this King's Road doesn't connect. So let's help it. He's supposed to... He could connect over here. Oh, he does. Just right there. Okay, let's do that. Okay. We own both provinces now. So that's where the... That's where the stream starts. And it's going... That direction. Okay. Must be a, a culvert in there. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, it, it goes under the mountain. Pops out somewhere else. Yeah. Um, over in here... One family available. It's going to be a while before we're ready to get new families over here. But how are we doing? The ones that are here are... Well, not really getting ahead. I don't dare touch them. The Tanner is still waiting to be... No, you are still... You are buildable now. Uh, storehouse. Where did I say that was? No, that was the other place. We need to put a tannery over here. We needed logs. Okay. Boyne is the one that has the tannery up near the, the hunting lodge. Yeah. So let's grab a tannery just to get it in place. And then we'll have to set one more house soon, too. Um, let's see. Construction, gathering. What well, looks like leather. Why am I not seeing you? Industry? Industry. Leather. Tannery. There we go. So animals are deeper in. They're going to come out, and they're eventually going to make it to this storehouse right here. So it makes sense that it's in this area. It could be tucked up a little bit further, and even tucked in a little bit like so. Where is my furthest out? Right there. Then we could road from here into... Let's go a little further. Make that curve. And come on into wherever the road is over here. It didn't quite make it. But you are animals. You're over in that area. Did I? I don't know if I even placed the hunting lodge. I don't think I did. Okay. So let's just take you on in. I'm not disturbing anything over here. And we'll just kind of drop you right there. And let's set a hunting lodge. So gathering meat. Nothing in there? Nothing's in there. You are a forager and... Yeah, just these three over here. So you can drop in somewhere like that. And you want to be in kind of in that direction. And there are no... Oh, there's a void right there. We'll do that. All right. So you will eventually get built. That was all of our logs. Okay. So still one person trying to gather logs, but they don't have far to go. You know, it's all right in this area. So they'll be dropping the logs right around us. There's part one right there. So yeah, you'll be, you'll be finishing up here soon. We've got one house built. These are going in fairly quick, so we're, we're prioritizing these. Anything there I need to change? Don't think so. You are what? Your supplies. Um, I'm not really worried about losing them. We could lose a little firewood, but we can replace firewood so quickly. In fact, we can. I'm curious. Can Gandalf send a pack station mule and pick up firewood when it's not already in a warehouse. I don't know. Let's find out. Anything important happening that I've been ignoring? Uh, Gloin's tannery got done. Let's... Is there any way to put somebody in there? Yeah, I'd say so. That was what I was really kind of waiting for. Let's put that one family in there and get this number up even higher by letting you put a clothing stall in. Yeah, and Tannery... Well, that's hunting camp. Did I not... That's a Tannery. Ah, there we go. You are from where? You're Gandalf's hunting camp. You have been sitting up here all this time? I guess so. I didn't even notice it. <laughs> anyway, Gandalf and... That's not a Gandalf. Gandalf looks like that. There we go. Um... Gandalf, let's 
first of all, let's evaluate what's going on. Have I forgotten to take anybody out of these? No, we're no longer doing any of these. So let's set you up. Same thing. Same thing. But let's send you to Pippin. Let's do that. And let's go grab Pippin's tools, too. If they're, if they're a thing, give you vegetables. Uh, right over there. Pippin doesn't need them. And... They don't need either of those two, and giving them a little extra food would be better. So those two families are going to be doing that. Uh, settlers join Pippin. Oh, okay, because we get more houses built. Great. So with that happening, yeah, there's a second house. Great. Which doesn't give us a, a bigger family count, but it gives us more bodies. Three family members instead of two family members. So these two need to go in, and we have one timber. As soon as we get one more timber... It was just a matter of uh, dropping branches off of something else. Where are you guys? People in here, you're... Yeah, there we go. So as soon as you get one more log going for us, I can put that extra extra house in. You are transporting water to your house, and you are in your house sleeping or something. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I got a house... Last night on the ground was, was rough. I'm going to go get some sleep. So it's going to be a while before that. Oh, there it is right there. That last one goes in. All right, so what direction? Let's go this way. Right there. Let's just hit H. Much easier than trying to figure out where houses are. Though we have this funky pathway in here. Um, okay, so you are going to turn in like that. And let's see what happens. A small footprint. Take you back into into here and across we're going to doesn't say how many trees we're going to lose it does give us two houses though okay um and we're going to lose that tree only unless this one counts i don't think it does all right we'll do that boom and we're not going to lose them until we actually put chickens in there which we can do that's right we have a little more coins because of the of starting it this way. So chickens go in just a little bit faster. So you guys are in. As soon as we can, I want to put a trading house in, a trading post, so we can start uh, moving stone and what have you out. So we need to get stone going, need to get firewood going and have them clear this area. Yeah, then we can start making ore, mining out the ore and sending that into the system too. So, speaking of that, what's happening over here? We're waiting until May before we get another family because we're not up to 75 yet. Though, we... Tannery and... Oh, we, we don't have a hunting camp, do we? We do. Let me think about that. You're over here. We already had this one filled up and then we moved over here. So, generic storage pantry this was zero of 12 on the other one now it's been taken down the storehouse the storehouse that let me think about that that's over here is the one that would have it actually this is this would be a little better to uh, have put the the tannery at near this one but eventually all of the leather all the hides are going to end up over here anyway we just don't have the people to uh, to run it okay so next person that comes in does this job and we start converting you know getting some cash rolling into here okay where am i at so far a little over half hour all right anything else i need to be doing otherwise let's think about that got two families over here in samwise um we didn't have much in the way of crops anymore so no barley left we've got 10 flax left. We're basically done with those until this next season. So I could take that last family out of the weaver's workshop and I could take the family out of the malt house. And there's no point in dealing with those anymore. The only flax and barley we have in the system now is what Gandalf is going to be buying. And they've, they've increased their coinage a little bit here. Good. So you guys are buying it off the market as you, know, as you can and then immediately converting it to malt and and um, linen. I don't have the, the farm going to convert the wheat, so we'll just let that build for a while. Only have one person available in here. All those uh, 
carcasses that came in, we're down to nine meat still. I have a feeling with this population, we're eating it as fast as we can drag it in. But at least now we know they're, they're still just making the trip to right here. I really would worry that they've gone all the way out into here. <laughs> That'd be just like us to uh, get our herd all the way to the very end of the world there. Um, so you guys... Hmm... Off the top of my head, I can't think of anything else I need to be tweaking. Berries are not getting out of control here or here, though you are building up some, but it's May. It is May, so we, that's why you built up. Beginning of the month, we get a burst of 40, and 6, we... Or was it already May? When did we get that 6 one? Was it April or May? Maybe it was. Okay, so the second half of May you get another burst. So Gimli is the one that, are we in Gimli? That gets the most, and they're still able to handle it just fine. How are quantities? You're almost full, you're not, and you're fine. You guys need to be, we have another family. Let's pop you into there, see if you can do a better job of keeping that one empty. Okay, uh, quantities out over here, you guys. You're almost full too. We have another family just popped in. So I thought I had only one in Gandalf a moment ago. Let's put a second one in here so you can help out emptying these, uh, where are you at right there? And emptying these pantries. The pantries that are further away from this are the ones that take the longest to make the trip. And they're also working on pulling meat out of the hunting cabins and what have you. So they've got other jobs to do too. Though the hunting cabins don't get really full of meat anymore because it takes so long to bring them in. Um, family member joined one of the settlers, Burgish Plot Level 2. Okay, so someone started moving in at the beginning of the month and now they finished the job. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Um, so Samwise... Nothing to do with crops. I did turn this one on. Yeah. And I did in between episodes. I set some more housing plots somewhere. Let me think about that. Was it out here? It was out here. So just kind of filling in some voids. We've got log-wise. We've got a lot of timber now. Let's set some more in. So houses. I wrote in between. That's probably a wise thing to do. In fact, let's just do it through here too. So you're going to go through like that, and let's cut you off and start you right there. Okay, that's better. Take you to there, then head up. Great. I'm hearing wind. Yep, thunderstorm coming in. Houses, and take you from there to there, up to just enough for chickens. You didn't grab, did you? Whenever this... UI this box is anywhere near it it will not uh, it will not grab even though I can see it right there I can click all I want it won't do any good so you're there to there to there okay that gives us chickens and everything just started lagging really bad wow I've noticed I'm over four minutes now to load the game so click you minus no, let's keep it this way. Let's get more chickens. Right there. So, I am starting to seriously tax the system. Which is understandable. The game is new. They have not gone through and fully optimized everything yet. Just thankful there are so many systems that are up and running. But, you know, later on I would imagine bigger towns will tax systems much less. Um, but we've got calculations probably happening for a thunderstorm brewing. Do we go all the way out to there? Yeah, we do that. And one plot is all we're going to get. Two more houses? Sure. Whether you're going to be vegetables? Probably not. But let's get you built. So we can be building those. Um, and I thought about finishing the pattern, putting in two more orchards out over here just for fun. So if we were to do that, we'd come off this road, maybe shoot over like this, there, and pop in, getting where I can see this a little better. There and into there. Okay. And let's fire you off kind of in that direction. 
and another smaller footprint off like that. Alright, something like that. Let's see what we can come up with. If I were to grab from here to here to here and then take you around. Oh, that worked first time. Yep, small house, big backyard. Go for it. You're there. So three points. One, two, and not too far. We'll go to there. Three. And then just kind of work it around, see what it does. Doesn't like this one. Let's go a little bit further up. See if that helps. Now, okay. Then let's go from here to here to there. Does that help at all? It just wants to do one side. Okay. So we'll go from there to there to there. What is the biggest we can do? It's like that. Hmm. Let's uh, grab, spin around. Hmm. Pippin got a point. Good. Let's go from here to here to there. I think that's all I'm going to get. Okay. We'll take it. You're there. And we could alter this a little bit, but let's see what we can do over here first. But let's go back to Pippin. Let's just make sure Pippin is... Is that the majority of this episode is this is a Pippin episode? So, you guys, one, two, three, four, five. That's what we got done. We are hurting on fuel, so firewood time. And we do have logs. Well, we got one or four, enough for you know uh, just a few projects. You and gather and firewood. And that's not firewood. There you are, firewood. And I want to take out this area. So firewood, let's come off of this this area right in here and tuck you in like, like so. All right, you're there and drag you something like that and kick your priority up. Let's get you done, get a family in there. And we, boy, it's so close. We could almost have a family coming in before June hits. That would be nice. Um, this is the one that I don't have an active hunter in, so I've got no way to make clothing. So that's probably not going to be a thing over here as far as getting it done before that month turns. I don't think there's enough incentive. Market food variety. I, you know, I guess that is possible. I am bringing veggies and eggs over, and they're here. Are they in the booth? You are a marketplace. You're a food stall. You've got two. If I can just get someone to bring over some eggs. Transporting. People. Um, yet I don't have any lines. Where are these people? Transporting. Husband. You are... i got to get out of follow mode. Then it'll show up. You're transporting berries. Oh, so you're just going to get the berries and you're bringing them back to the the uh, forager's hut for the granary. Yeah, okay. Uh, basket, and just out of curiosity, you are, click away, transporting berries too. Okay. Uh, supplies are damaged over here. And, yeah, that's fine. Did we, so we must have been able to use the firewood because we did get the deliveries. You are eggs for firewood, though I don't know if you've already hit the firewood or not. You are probably going here to drop off the eggs. Okay. Out of curiosity, let's just sit and watch that, see what you do. Um, anything else here? Pippin, family members join. Gimli, construction finish, level three. We're, we're not far from a uh, point on uh, at Gimli. Running out of fuel, yeah. That last point in, in Gimli. You did drop into here. You are... There you are. You are taking mule back. So apparently you are done. Does the mule say what's going on? Just the mule is following, and you're taking the mule back. <laughs> Not that we're delivering berries or anything. Okay. I just looked up and noticed something. We got a lot of taxes last time. Wow. How far, how fast are we pulling these things in? Not that fast. It's only 300. Out of all that. I guess we've had two runs of it so far, right? 
Yeah, there's another probably seven total between the two. Okay, and we were... Yeah. Okay, I guess that works out. So, over here, real quick, we do have five timber. Let's just quickly get set a hunter's lodge uh, here. In case I didn't do that. I did do it. Okay, you're in there. And then a tannery right there. Did that happen? You are actually right there under construction. Okay, so those two are done, or being done. You are the firewood. You're being done. And we'll hopefully drop somebody in one of those real quick. We're at 50. Oh, if we can just get one more. Um, if we only had this built too, we could then get another stall going, firewood going. Yeah, a lot of ifs. If I were to do that, I doubt it could be done by by June. And then get a stall going if I would actually end that stall. Don't know. Yeah. This is probably the f more likely thing that's going to get done first. It probably is. Let's take you down a notch. In fact, let's pause. Take you down one notch so that you don't give up and walk over there next. And if there's a possibility of getting this done before June and toggling to have a family in there and do the uh, uh, the booth, the, the, the firewood stall, maybe we could hit 51. If Jacob here, if, if, if Jakob could uh, get pound those logs, pound the ground is a little bit faster. Come on, you can do it. There we go. So this one doesn't need any more supplies. And where's, where's your buddy? You've all got houses now, so you should have your whole family here. So you should have a wife and a son helping you build this. And what is that? I don't know. Fire, that must be the fire pit that's going in. Yeah, we still gotta build all this though. There's a whole other shed that goes in. There's the fire pit. Still May. I wish there was a bit of a timer. How far into May are we really? But you are so close. There you are. So, Woodcutter's Lodge put a family in. Just go straight in and... Actually, you're set. You don't even need to take a tree down, really. Firewood already exists. The game should already know about it. Where's the old... I guess it's here. Now, here, here. It's gone. We have zero firewood? We have zero firewood. That's why the game is panicking. Okay. Food alone is probably not enough to push us over. Not unless those eggs make it. Ah, uh, right there, and they have not made it. Are you bringing eggs? You're transporting berries. Someone's got to be bringing these eggs over here. We've got eggs sitting right there. 22 of them. Hmm. Okay, well, let's turn off the the uh, trips over here. There is still May, so not June yet, but let's take you out. Did that work? I didn't hear the click. And click away somewhere that doesn't trigger another box. Right there, minus you. Okay, so, boy, all kinds of angry. Um, Gimli food stall. Pippin running out of fuel. Pippin uh, supplies damage. Pippin unassigned families. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be fine. Don't worry so much. <laughs> anyway, over in here we do have one free family now. So let's get you into here. Get that, that stone sold off. Great. Anything else in here to sell off? Firewood is a thing yet? Woodcutter's Lodge is not a thing. Uh, firewood, otherwise, we have 43. And we're wanting them to keep how much? Right in there. Firewood is not set yet. Okay, so we will full trade you, and you will maintain... Probably should maintain 100, realistically. Probably so. And then charcoal, we can get you going full trade and maintain uh, 100 as well. Though, let's not deal with that just yet. They haven't got the funds to, to pull that off. Don't even have the funds to pull this off, really. Let's not do this yet. So we're going to turn all those off, and we'll just we'll just run in-house. 
so they don't accidentally start buying it just to uh, balance themselves out. They're not ready for balancing yet. Okay, so Gloin is okay for a while. We'll just let them cook. Berries are just about maxed out. I've got two in here. I think we're just going to have to let it go because I don't want to... Yeah, animals are maxed out too. I don't want to stop what, what we're doing otherwise. We finally have all three in here. Good numbers. And increase those numbers a little bit more. We're going to get two families in this time. In fact, we probably will. No, we're in May. Well, by the middle of June, we should be up to that 75 mark. I think so. Because we'll have a good set of second numbers, the 5 and 3, to move down below to add to a new 5 and 3 up above. And there'll be firewood in there. Firewood's not showing. Does firewood not show? Let's find out. Over here, let's get a uh, more of a veteran uh, place. No, just food variety, church level, and clothing marketing supply. Okay. Um, Pippin, how you doing? Pippin does not have a new fam. 51, and it's still May. All right, it made it. Did you get eggs in here, or did it just accumulate? Uh, we have two stalls now. That's what it is. Firewood stall, and there's a firewood in there. Okay, that, that probably did it. Though it's claiming it's just food variety. The eggs made it. Aha. Good. So is it a point per kind? I never thought to look at that. I mean, we have a lot of kinds of food over here. So let's just grab a market. In general, food variety. We have one, two, three, four, five kinds of food. So does that give us market or food variety five? Uh, food variety last time was nine. So that's... I may have an additional multiplier of how many food stalls there are or the complete coverage of food stalls you know food variety but also this counts as coverage how many houses have access so more food stalls give you more access around town so it's probably a you know a combination of all of that um noises burgage plots okay um, over in here, did you ever get moved in? You did not! Oh, and it might not. We hit all these tier threes to get us in that direction. And that means that we now have twice as many families that need to move into them. It may be forever before we get to this last plot. Yeah, there, there is that. Okay. Um, I do remember, though, I, though I want to check on this. You're fine. I do remember I was trying to set more of these around. So let's continue with this. One more try over here. Uh, house. And we have a well over here. That's going to mess things up. Let's throw a road. Uh, you're fine there. Let's throw a road across like that. And down. And see what that does to this lot as far as being able to manipulate it. If we go, boy, I'd love to save those trees. Is that possible? If I were to start out here on purpose, go there to there to there, what do we get? Kind of funky. He doesn't like it. Okay, I guess we're not going to save the tree. We went from there to there to there is it possible to it is and that works that's close enough oops I was up in the UI I wouldn't take my click okay now I can alter it a little bit no nope, you get one choice here one choice only thank you and uh, please build okay so this spot over here is probably going to not be you guys could just be chickens how does that look so H and go from here to here to there and around. So that gives us not even a chicken. Okay. So if we were to go from here to there to there. Something crazy like that. Now, if we're going to do this, we may as well get two houses in there. There's two houses and a chicken. And an even better chicken. <laughs> okay. I'll work with that. Alrighty. Alright, so back over here. And where am I now? Getting close to that uh, that finishing spot. You know, close to an hour. Alright, so in Pippin. 
any last minute things to do. Let's think this through. So gathering, we got logs, we have firewood, we do not have a saw pit yet. We do have 18 logs. So let's go ahead and just kind of start setting everything. Log or saw pit can be over here. Your logs are coming out of there. Let's spin you like so and put you right about there. And then a forester. Yeah, let's do that. We'll, we'll put you over on this side. And we do need to kind of, we need to kind of head out and around. And there is a Gimli point. We finally got it. So you're in there and you're going to make your way over to here like that. And we want to, let's see, mining. Let's set up a stonecutter's camp right out over here great let's set up a mining pit for clay right in here do we do two i don't know that we'll ever have the population to handle two but i guess i could go ahead and just set it anyway you are you're not a mine i don't know what you are but you're definitely not what i thought you were and in that case no i'm not going to deal with that so let's spin you around so you're coming out this way and set you kind of like that and drop a road in from there to there and there to there. Okay. So we can mine that. We can mine that. And did we ever get you going? Yes, we did. Let's tell you to work over in, in here. Okay. So make you a little bigger. You should still be well out of the berries if I do that. Perfect. You're going to work over there. You're going to clear that out. Um, real quick, going through the last of these... Okay, Forrester, we did set you. We're not going to do that. We have these two already done. Over in here, we have you done. You two are done. Uh, residential, we really could use more houses. Let's just do it this way. Do that so that we can continue expanding over here. We'll just fill these in right there. That all of you? I think so. Okay. So all of you are set, though it didn't feel like I got to you. We're out of logs. Okay. So I'm going to say we're good there as far as a start for Pippin. Over here, we do have a... No, we don't have another family. We will soon. We will soon. We have plenty of houses. Are you going yet? You're not. Look at you this way. So we're starting to work over here. You're the last one. All right. Food and fuel. You're fine. Over here... Uh, Pippin, and what do I want? Fuel is the only problem. Food is fine. Okay. And berries, did you ever... We're still overwhelmed on berries. And we could set a policy to give us more animals over here, too. So, long term, there is that. We'll do that as well over here, I think. Um... Otherwise, am I kind of done? Gimli's point. That's where we're at. So Gimli, your last point is going into plate armor. And close. And let's just set that before we leave. Now, plate armor is not a very quick thing. I want armorer. You're right over here. This is where Earhart lives, right? <laughs> uh, right there. And you're finally warm. Well, one of the air hearts. Yeah, you're finally warm. But the armor shop is going to general start putting out plate armor. And you'll be selling that? Not necessarily. Yeah, you will be selling that because well, I'll be curious to see what happens. Next time, uh, it takes eight um, slabs of iron in order to make one plate armor. So be aware of that. But once they hit their first uh, plate armor. I'd be curious to see if their revenue retinue still takes though I have no way to prove it till we kill off a few more of their retinue. Yeah, we're completely uh, loaded. Hmm. Well, after the next battle which might be next episode. We might go play with one of these two next time. We'll see. It's either that or we'll continue building up uh, Pippin just a little bit longer. Yeah, we'll see about that. But as soon as there's a save, which tells me I'm, I'm done or long since done, but as soon as we get our first casualty on this retinue, and then we can go in and try to upgrade and see what the, the costs are. If we actually have our own plate armor here, does it change that bug? 
Does it take the 999 and the 499 and bring it back to the, the 29 and 14 they're supposed to be? But with that, I'm going to call this done. We are paused. We'll, yeah, we'll, we'll park right over here just to remind me that I want to uh, check out our first plate armor when it's done. But this has been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, folks. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.